in many communities that 911 is available in, there is a time from the time you make that call until the time that rescuers get to your home. That time sometimes is critical. And that's why the, the rescuer is a very important tool. It's easy to use, it's interactive, it's at the palm of your hands, literally. And the rescuer is a very functional tool to help in, in multiple injuries. If there are eye injuries or musculoskeletal complaints, if there are ankle sprains or more severe type of medical conditions such as somebody being unconscious or having a stroke, the rescuer will guide you through real time decision making. Sometimes that decision making needs to be done on the, in the blink of an eye and that's why the rescuer is a very useful tool. And it's not just useful for people who have medical knowledge. It is a great resource for people that are in education or people that are traveling abroad or people that are in charge of church groups or field trips. It is some, it's a, a device, an assist device that should be in the hands of anybody who interacts with other people or anybody that plans on traveling. Or it's, there's nothing scarier when people come into the emergency department when they're out of their home element. If they're traveling from out of state and they get here, they get very nervous. And that's, we try to calm them by, and treat them and treat their injuries. And also when you're traveling, the rescuer provides that same amount of comfort. If you're hiking and you get injured and you need to know what to do, you can use the rescuer as a really easy access tool. Oftentimes, even when we practice, the heat of the moment gets us excited and sometimes we need to be refocused and have a pocket tool that is ready to help us go through the medical condition. The rescuer does that. The rescuer is easy to use, it's great for the layperson, and it's also good for the volunteer or the people who are practicing medicine right now.